sent my youngins to pick mushrooms yesterday. Slow now. Oh, oh, that one. Oh, no. You know how it is. Excuse me, sir. What do you mean? Ye deaf. Be gone, you blasted mutant. Where's all this hate for witchers coming from? Where? I'll tell you where. One of yous came here, ate his fill for two days while he thunk things over. Then he says he'd do us a favor and kill our monster. What's your price? I asked. But he said he wanted no coin, for he saw we'd none to offer. Hmm. That doesn't sound like a witcher to me. Awfully noble of him. Thought so too, at first. Said for pay he'd take something I had that did not yet know about. Then he left, and here the door swung shut behind him. My lass started wailing. What's these tears? I asked. Oh, I can't bear it, she says. I'll kill the horse and... Go on. Fool girl wept that some beast was gonna kill the witcher dead. Ye howling for a mutant, I said. Then she told me, told me, Bugger had bewitched her with his evil eye, seduced her, and that were to be his prize. A witcher's bastard. That's almost how the Law of Surprise works, but there's um, a hole in that story. If he's really a witcher, you don't have a thing to worry about. We can't sire children. Thank the gods any more of you and we'd be lost. This one, he beguiled me daughter, rutted her neath me own roof. That I can't forgive. Tell me where he is. Take care of this for you. Cemetery. Went there to slay the monster. Hope the corpse eater guts that fornicated freak. Oh, there's something there. Cool. Pretty straightforward. Oh. Hmm. Strange. What was this by the uh Oh, it's a dead bunny. Oh, the ghoul killed it, presumably. Thank you, thank you. You came just in time. A moment more and that ghoul would have filleted me like a flounder. Actually, not sure I should have intervened. Your combat style, it's new to me. Should have just observed. Where'd you complete your training? School of the Snail? Uh -huh. And where'd you get your wolf's head medallion? You're... You're the real thing? A witcher? Mm-hmm. What gave it away? That I didn't wet my trousers at the sight of one lousy ghoul? Answer the question. Where do you get the medallion? I bought it from a traveling peddler. Oh, the villagers are coming. Don't tell him about me, please. Monster slain. Oi, what's this? Two witchers? We only hired one. Let's see. Maybe I want to deal with this guy uh, on my own. Monster was fierce. Took two witchers to take it down. That's between you two. This and didn't want coin, so you've none to quarrel over. Of course. So this witcher demanded the traditional reward. One other hallowed witcher's principle you should be aware of then. Yeah? What's that? Hmm. I think if he did get that girl pregnant, he probably should be around to observe the results. Any witcher needing a brother's aid must then bury his medallion in the earth. In doing so, he renounces his trade. Then he's got to work for the village elder for a year. You can take him there now. The witcher's surely worth two ordinary laborers. At least two. Farewell. Bye. He, he did look a little bit like Lambert. I'll give him that. The 
I think we can just run right there now. Oh no, maybe not. Oh, run, Roach, run, Roach. Okay. Whoa, okay, fine. Nice. Excellent. I think we leveled up the sword at least once there. Hello? Oh, oh it's Gert Borel! Gert! What's wrong? Looking for ghouls? Why? No one else to do me in. Been in a bad way for days. Final breaths like... Somehow can't die. So strong since I were a lad, damn it. Hmm. We met before. I Pulled me from under a pile of stiffs. I was sure their scourge had never touched me. So sure, so foolish. Listen. You did me a kindness once. Do me another. Got a sharp sword there. Finish this. He said he was on his last legs. This is surely better than him wandering around trying to get ghouls to kill him. And it does look like the plague, and we don't want him wandering around spreading it even more. You sure? I beg you! Do it quick, then burn my remains! All right. Sangi, take this. Thought I'd leave some coin for me young'uns. But I've no need of it now. Oh. Wow. Poor Kurt. The implication being that he brought the plague to his family, so they are dead now as well. That's so sad. Is this his house? Not much here. Probably not. I'm sorry, Gert. Down, Warren. Look at you actually manifesting in a field. Oh, wait. Oh, 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 wait. I forgot. I need to burn him. I need to burn him. There we go. I'm sorry, Roach. The one time. Alright, we're good now. Gotta see if we can find it. Oh! Found it. Get out of here, Neckers! Oh! Oops. Whoa! Wow. These guys are fast. Whoa! Nice. We got him, Horus. Good time, man comes. <laughs> Green in your bubble gun. What you got in the pot? Oh, super la cops. Trolls all family. <laughs> Much goods. <laughs> Slinks, froggies, bone helps. Joy smell sticks. Last one necro for flavor full. <sighs> Putting Neckers in your soup? Is that why they got mad? Necro one! Don't know soup tastes good! 
Necros of this comb, but mine no call them. Well, you put one of their brothers in the pot. It's natural they'd be a bit upset. Oh, these are wanting to? <laughs> Jealous is... No, it's more like... Many gods now? Many much for soup? You may be. Necras good as rotten. More saucy. Ah, huh? kind, nice man. Troll help. Take board. Elf is good. Like tomato. <laughs> Okay, I think that's a little more interesting. Well, Boris, you're welcome. So let's look at this elf head. Where would it be? Here? Troll delicacy. I guess I'll just carry this around. Yes, Geralt? Hmm. Okay. Look what I picked up. Artifact compression. Someone got themselves enchanted in this figurine. Intend to decompress? Of course. Whoever cast the spell on the poor soul must have forgotten about him. Looks like a nobleman. Could be just that. Come with me. I can't perform the ritual here. Everything's ready. Let's get to work. Place is pretty grim. True. It looks like a vampire's hideout. Which is why we can be pretty sure no one will bother us here. Give me the figurine and stand <laughs> back. Okay. Let's try it. Think it's a nobleman. Be on your guard. It could be something far more dangerous. At the last, you are my one and only. Oh, 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 you're not Coral. Some succubus. A, a delusion. Where, where, where am I? Aha, uh -huh, Coral. So Coral, for background, has been dead for some time. So this guy's been a statue for some time as well. So Coral enchanted him, just like her. If there's a more vindictive sorceress, I don't know her. Well, except maybe... Coral's not here? In that case, come to me, Succubus. Ugh. No, thank you. What is your name? Hmm? We're in Novigrad. Novigrad. In Novigrad? Last I recall, I was in Oxenfurt, and Coral was furious. How can she demand fidelity when she herself is wanton as... as... As youthful goats. <laughs> exactly. Damn it! I feel as if I've been trampled by a herd of cattle. I've no notion what she did to me. But it seems you've delivered me from my misfortune. Here, take this. Have a good time. Paint the town coral. Whose taste has grown worse since you were sleeping with her. Come on, the kind-hearted gentleman will get along fine on his own. I'm still kind of confused why they refer to her in the present tense. But... Okay, not bad. Thank you, sir. 